DJ Calm Down, Calm Down TV. Very special guest today, Sean P. What's good, what's good? Hey. Thanks for having me, bro. Oh, it's a pleasure. I'm glad you came. No problem, no problem. Now, uh, Sean P, that's real name? Uh, yeah, um, my real name, right now, I don't want to say it. I mean, yeah. if you figure it out yourself, you figure it out. Uh, yeah. But we're going with Sean P. Yeah. Um, I got that name from pretty much all the artists from Nashville, Tennessee. Uh, I used to go by Sean the Producer. Mm. Um, and then Lotus Music, he pretty much was like, bro, I ain't finna call you Sean the Producer every time I uh, tag you in it. So he said, I'm from now on, I'm gonna call you Sean P. It uh, sounded like Lotus. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he funny. Shout out to Lotus. Yeah, shout out Lotus. You know, we uh, we working, we we back in the lab. Um, I got, uh, if y'all don't know, uh, I did produce his first album. Um, mm -hmm. Whether whether y'all got good feedback from it or bad feedback, it don't matter. It was it was, it was was an album that, you know, and his his demographic ain't nobody had no um no album out and his, uh he just graduated from high school so he ain't nobody had an uh, album out that was on his level at that time so yeah, he definitely moved like an older guy yeah 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 Lotus he moved like a uh, he an old head like he got an old head mindset so it's just like um yeah but he be with, he be with Wesley Wesley Crutcher a lot so yeah you know he spit again shout out to Wesley five out mm -hmm. all right now where you from I'm from Springfield Illinois. Okay, born and raised. Yeah, born and raised. Uh, repping the two one seven all the way, you know. But I'm six one five, but I rep two one seven too. So you came down here when? I came down here at the age of eighteen, uh, and that was two thousand fourteen. Okay. Now, when did exactly you get into music? I got into music when I was around around the age of five. Um, pretty much, I've been in music all my life. Um, Always hip hop. Uh no, nah, it wasn't hip hop. I did. It was it was gospel. It was gospel. I started off in gospel. Um, cause I started off playing the drums in the church at the age of five. My dad, he was on the organ slash music music director. So mm -hmm. I got most of my knowledge um, from him and uh, mentors around in the church that dealt with audio and engineering and stuff. So yeah. Um, yeah. Okay. Now you uh, play the drums. Any other instruments you play? Yeah, I play the drums. That's my main instrument that I'm, I'm really, really good at. I also play the piano um, and I can play the organ. And the, uh, my secret instrument is the violin. Okay. So. I ain't bringing my girl around you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, <Yeah. Aw>, man. <laughs> okay. Now, um, ever like rap or sing as a as you got older? All right, so look, I um once I started um making beats, I used this software uh called Reason. Mm -hmm. Uh and I had beats. I didn't have nobody singing on them. So I started rapping, but then the first two tracks, I heard myself and I said that shit trash. So I stuck mm -hmm. I stuck the beats and then I just started going around the high schools uh and start recording different artists um, and then i started my own little my own little group called rmg royal music group um and uh started recording them at that time i didn't know how to record but we made it work yeah now i'm gonna talk about some of the artists that i've seen you produce mm -hmm. for because you got a lot of especially nashville hottest yeah. names on the list and you know you know sean p we, we only work with the best yeah so let's start with CJ the Great. Yeah, CJ the Great. That's that's my artist. I uh, I, I um, me and him, we we like we like like brothers. We like this now. So it's just like um, yeah, that's like that's like yeah, that's little bro. Yeah, we got Lotus of course. Lotus music, yup, yup, yup. Uh, Fredo Ruthless. Yes sir, yes sir. I just linked up with him. Okay, Camille Airy. Yup, yup. I just had the pleasure of doing her uh, interview. Mm -hmm. Shout out Camille. Mm hmm. She. Lil Crimson. Lil, yes, Lil Crimson. Yeah, we got we got some we got some works. Exclusive. Yep, we yeah, man. I I was blessed. I was blessed to get a replacement with him. Six one five exclusive yeah. to be exact. Six one five. Shout out to you, bro. Appreciate that placement too. Uh, AJ the Snow. AJ Snow. Yeah, that's AJ my guy Snow. from two one seven. That's hometown. And the late great NFL Mister. Yes, man. R I P Y G, bro. Like. Man, let me just go ahead and tell you a story about that that guy, man. Okay, so he came to me. He didn't know how to rap at the time. He came to me like, bro, you got a studio. Um, and how I met Mr. was through my, my friend Will. He produces well. Um, he go by Ratchet Beats. Mm -hmm. uh, and how I met him was he was recording. So he was like, bro, I got this, 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 this. my homeboy named uh, Mr. He go by Mr. Mm -hmm. And um, he pretty much was like, 
uh, and you record him, bro, he gonna fuck with you. So I was just like, shit, fuck it. Um, so me and Mr. Um, we started we started linking up, bro. So it was just like he was dropping music, but it was just like he had so much music. So be on the lookout. He got something dropping. I can't say too much, but it, y'all gonna love it. I promise. Yeah. Um, all, uh, all, uh, this one was actually hosted by me. Um, I didn't. I produced a couple tracks up on it. Most of them are jacking for beats, but mm-hmm. I produced a couple tracks up on it. But yeah. Okay. Now. Um, tell me what you got going on. All right, so look, I got a project called Hashtag Ushan, that's five. That's consistent of all the artists that you said and then some. Um, and what I'm doing with this project is pretty much putting putting artists in positions to either get a deal, get clout, or whatever it is. I'm just putting them on it because it's just like everybody don't want to work together. So it's just like, shoot, I'm a producer, so I'm going to just use what I got, my power, um, and put artists on, on beats that I don't produce for, mm-hmm. and they ship it out, on the, they put on their project, but I'm put on my project, and the people that are working with me, that I work with on collabs, mm-hmm. they gonna drop their project right after me, so it's just like, um, yeah. it's just like, so everybody got something when they drop it, they'll be prepared, so. Okay. Now, is there, um, t- I'm gonna talk about the beats, mm-hmm. the, when you're making beats or yeah. producing, whatever. Um, is there any specific sounds that you like the most or? Man, for real, for real. Um, I just go with the flow. Like I wake up, if I'm in a good mood, Mm -hmm. I'm going to make a good mood beat. If I'm in a bad mood, I'm going to make a, uh, like a dark beat. If I'm, I'm feeling sad or down, that's where the R&B start coming in. So, uh, as far as, as far as me really just sitting down and planning it out now nah, i just i yeah. freestyle it and if an artist wants something then you know yeah we okay you got uh any favorite producers yes 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 mike will made it yeah uh quincy jones most definitely quincy jones um dr dre most definitely uh and uh who was it i got timberland no id mm-hmm. and kanye kanye west yeah Man. okay what about uh, artists like musicians or rappers in general? In general, uh, let me see. Uh, well, I said that back as rappers or musicians in general. <laughs> so, like, can you like re uh, re? Like, if I was to ask you a top five, like Put my top five artists. Yeah. Okay. Um, my top five artists. Oof. Mm. I'm gonna have to go with Kendrick as number one. Okay. I'm gonna have to go with J. Cole at number two. And then if we wanna get to the mm-hmm. to the new wave, I'm <laughs> I'm slick, I'm slick rocking with 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 twenty one. Uh oh. Twenty one side. <laughs> okay. Uh, That's a good list. And uh ooh. I'm r i am see NBA and I can't forget Kevin Gates. Can't forget Kevin Gates. Kevin can't forget Kevin Gates. That's probably the most unique top five. Yeah, yeah, it's different. It's different. It's just like I don't when I listen to the artists, I don't really listen to like I listen to what they talk about sometimes, but mm-hmm. most of the time I listen to like what beat they on because I, I I got that that aspect. So it's just like I like NBA how he takes the the beat and he rides it, and I like how Kevin Gates he does the same thing, but he talking to you like it's it's, yeah. it's some real shit. Um, and then Kendrick shit, it's just Kendrick. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Now, have you always been in the? Uh, or have you always had dreams to be a musician or producer? Um, yeah. So soon as I realized what a producer did and how much they made, mm-hmm. uh, that's what I decided I wanted to be. Um, and then once I got once I got to uh, my junior year in high school, mm-hmm. teachers was pulling me out of class talking about. Um, so what you gonna do when you do, go after uh, when you graduate? Um, and stuff like that, and they'll tell me I gotta go to school. I'm just like, I ain't gotta go to school. Um, I don't, I don't promote that though. Um, it took me years to get to uh, to what I did now, but you know, school. If you if you know what you wanna do and you know your your your, your um your field you wanna be in, yeah, go to school, get that, get that degree. Definitely. Well, um, ever uh, played any sports, anything like that? <laughs> Yeah, I uh, at middle school I did track, I did that my freshman year in high school as well. But I quit because 
the difference between middle school track and high school track is high school track is more serious. And <laughs> I was too focused on I was too focused on music at the time. Yeah. So um, I did marching band in, in high school, but um, I did football for like two games. I got my ass whacked. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I told dude, I said I I gotta keep my hands. Yeah. <laughs> I'm too small to play football. I ain't yeah. even try. You ain't had to worry yeah. about it. Oh, and in my senior year, I did tennis too. So yeah, that shit was that was different. That was different. Okay.